what I want to show you is, is some of the, the internal processes of the skull to allow rams to butt heads. In a recent outdoor report, we took a look at some of the unique characteristics of Rocky Mountain bighorn sheep that make them physically durable and well adapted to their habitat. As tough as they are in combat and agile in the rocky cliffs, bighorn sheep can fall prey to the smallest of microscopic bacteria. All the major die-offs that we've had are pneumonia events. There's a lot that we don't know about the bacteria that causes those die-offs. Pneumonia is a really important disease in bighorn sheep because it has the potential in some cases to um, kill off a lot of the population. So there are pneumonia outbreaks that cannot be traced back to any specific cause or source. Bighorn sheep are about the only big game species that we can see a population disappear over a winter. And we've lost in the last three years through die-offs around 1,500 bighorn sheep, so we're down around 5,000 sheep in the state right now. Uh, there's work being done at Washington State University that's showing some promise as far as developing a vaccine. At a recent Wild Sheep Foundation convention, one Montana bighorn hunting license sold at auction for $300,000. 10% stays with the Wild Sheep Foundation, with 90% of the proceeds returning to Montana earmarked for bighorn sheep research and management. This is Mike Grinnell out among Montana's Fish, Wildlife and Parks.